You must be tired of these lectures. I know I'm tired of giving them. And now you have to stay here with me all weekend instead of going on the retreat with everyone else? I don't care. Yes, that is the crux of the problem. I don't see why I'm the only one being punished. Because you started the fight. You wouldn't give me back my book. I told you to leave those books in your room. You only have yourself to blame. Doesn't give him the right to just snatch it from me. Does that give you the right to start throwing punches? It wasn't just about the book. What was it then? Nothing. I'll save it for confession. No matter what I try, you seem insistent on going down the same sad road as your brother. What a waste. See you. Up and around we go. Whoa! Too slippery. Isn't it our job to help boys like him? In the meantime, I'm neglecting the other dozen boys under my care. <sighs> what do you want me to do? You know my opinion. <laughs> I'm not ready to give up on him yet. You can't keep avoiding it. 
Look, I'll talk to him in the morning. Okay? Good night, Father. Good night, Sister Catherine. file. Nathan, come with me, young man. Sam? Ooh, you gotta learn to watch your back. <laughs> All right. Hey, it's good to see you, little brother. What was that? Really? Again? It's nothing. You told me you'd stay out of trouble, though. He was talking shit about us. So? He said that Dad dumped us here because we're worthless, and Mom is in hell because- Nathan, Nathan, come on. They're just saying it because it gets to you, all right? You just gotta learn to laugh it off. You wouldn't. Well, do as I say, not as I do. Here. You'll catch a cold. So, what are you doing here like this anyway? If the nuns catch you, they're gonna call the cops. Well, I got something for you. And I couldn't wait till Christmas. What? It's outside. What happened to us staying out of trouble? Uh, this is an exception. Mm-hmm. <laughs> nice jump. Come on, here. Give me a hand. <laughs> she she might. The sister's feeding you enough. <sighs> The place is kind of empty. Where is everyone? Some Bible retreat. Yeesh. I remember those. How's Father Duffy doing? He's the one decent guy in there. You should come and say hi. Nah. I don't need the guilt. You didn't prop it. I, I did. At least I thought I did. No, it doesn't matter. We're gonna take the high road. The high road?
Just follow me. Watch this. Oh. And now, we take the high road. Have you done this before? Uh, once or twice. Here, come on. Your turn. What you been up to? I'm working mostly. You still dating that girl? Uh, oh, uh, Crystal? Yeah. On again, off again. Currently, off again. Okay. No guts. No glory. Oh, oh, oh. Just don't think about it. You got this. big deal. Yeah. Nothing to it. Stay with me. <sighs> Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Totally. Hey, through here. Right behind you. Jump coming up. Okay. Okay. Right down the middle. Nice and easy. Ah. Huh. Oops. Was that a sin? I think that's a sin. Are you ready, Tarzan? Yeah. All right, go ahead. Jump that high. All right, just go around the corner. It's a nice view, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. You ever been up here before? This particular roof? No. But you do know where you're going, right? Eh, more or less. Wait here, and you watch me. Oh, oh, oh. Ah. Your turn. Okay, you got this. You got this, Nate. All right, go ahead. Don't overthink it. Oh crap! Yeah. Of course she did. Here, follow me. You know what? How about you take this one? Really? Yeah, really. 
I'll follow your lead. Attaboy, Nathan. Okay. Whoa! <sighs> okay. All right. After you. Now, head down. Just like that, we're out. All right. Check it out. Huh? Whoa, <laughs> you got the 250? 250? What are you talking about? No, this is the 500 cc twin no way yeah where'd you lift it from whoa that's a low blow but hey i'll have you know that i am a changed man bought this with hard-earned cash here come on take a seat what the only time you pull a stunt like this is when you're trying to make up for something you are too smart for your own good you know that all right I got this job. Pays well. Really well. But, uh, I gotta leave town for a little bit. What's a little bit? Uh, like, uh, a year. At the most, and then I'll be back before you even know it, all right? You're bailing on me. Uh, come on, don't be so dramatic. What, so it wasn't bad enough to leave me in that place? How could you do this to me, Sam? Hey, wait, I'm doing this for you. The money I make is for the both of us. And then in a couple of years, when you're out... years? Take me with you. I, I can barely support myself. I'll pitch in. I know you think the orphanage sucks. You have no idea. Yeah, but it's the best thing for you right now. All right? You just gotta trust me on that one. It's not fair. Hey. Nothing about our lives has been fair. But we've made it work. Right? Sure. Well, you know, the bike wasn't the only surprise. And I guess I'm gonna have to ruin the next one. What? I found Mom's stuff. Everything that Dad sold, I tracked down the buyer. If you're saying this just to make me feel better... Yeah, I swear to God. Where? Yeah. On the other side of town. What do you say we go and get it back? You mean steal it? It's not stealing if it was ours to begin with. I'm pretty sure the cops aren't going to see it that way. Well, then let's not get caught. You ready for this? Hell yeah. Esto va a estar más fácil de lo que esperaba, eh? You're gonna have to do it better than that, pal. Acabemos con esto. Let's go. Ah, eres puro cuento. Dale! Buen día, coach. Eres puro cuento. Ah, los sin dientes. Vuelve ahí. Esto va a ser divertido. Más de gringo. Chingada, este gringo sabe pelear, eh. Dale una madriza. A ver cómo te sales de esta. Dale la cara. ¿Qué tal esto? Has hold it for me. Agárrenmelo. Lucha como un hombre. Alright. Good sport. I got you now. Toma esto, pendejo. Rompe el caño, amigo. Come on. Vuelve ahí. Sí, Gustavo. Come on, amigo. Esto es para meterte con nosotros. Ahora sí, pendejo. Te rote ese gringo, amigo. Vas a arrepentir. Ya lo tienes. Yeah. Oh, shit. 
¡Shit! ¡Te voy a matar, come mierda! ¡Te voy a cerrar la bocota, gringo! ¡Qué ¡Ya basta! ¡Cagaste, idiota! ¡Suéltame! We weren't fighting, huh? Right, little guy? Voy a matar, gringo, come mierda. Hey, give me a car when you're tall enough to ride the rides. Te voy a sacar las tiras por el culo. Solitaria. Cállalo. Te voy a estar esperando aquí, eh. Abre. Come on. How long am I supposed to be in here? Huh? Where's the toilet? You looking at it. Have fun. I will. Gracias. having a great dream too hey 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 all right easy ah Go. all right calmate yeah uh, any chance I can take a shower Cállate. Morning, boys. Or is it the evening? I, it's hard to tell down here. Oye, idiota! Get up the stairs. Viene saliendo un prisionero. Abran la reja. Hey, nice to see you. <laughs> right. Humid. Welcome to Panama. Hey, gringo. Vi lo que hiciste a Gustavo. Tengo un Estás cuchillo muerto. que tiene tu nombre, amigo. Te lo hey, Vargas. Cuando regrese. Déjanoslo a nosotros. Nos encargamos Atrás. de él. Muévanse. Quítense, cabrones. Hey, hey. Tranquilízate. Looks like you have some fans. Yeah, my adoring public. Abre la reja. ¿A dónde lo llevas? <laughs> es una sorpresa. <laughs> <laughs> Diviértete. I do speak a little Spanish, you know. <laughs> Wait, what, what did you say? You'll find out soon enough. Te <laughs> lo mirando? Nada, amigo. Atrás. De este me encargo yo. Bien. Where are you taking me anyway? You'll see. No, no. Not that way. Oh, all right. Yeah, this isn't sketchy at all. Hey, you know, this doesn't look like the warden's office. Go left. Yeah, I'm on it. Through there. Through here? Take these cuffs off or what? I want in. In? Whatever you hope to find up there, I want in. <laughs> now, come on, Vargas. The deal was just to get us in and out of here. That's it. Just? I'm sticking my neck off for you, gringos. Yeah, and Rafe is paying you a lot of money for your trouble. See? But 
not nearly enough. You were told not to open that? Yes. I was also told not to take bribes, not to bring anyone here, and not to beat on my inmates. But here we are. Just be careful with that. It's 300 years old. I was a member of Captain Henry Avery's crew. You know who that is? He was a pirate. The pirate who pulled off the biggest heist in history and got away with it. I looked him up. It's great. Over Can 400 we... million dollars worth of gold and jewels, all from one single ship. The, the Gunsway. Yeah. yeah. I'm familiar with the story. Can you get to the point? Uh-huh. I occupied the highest cell in the Spaniard's prison. <laughs> Here. I hope someday you will find your way into this infernal place, bear my cross, and discover the riches of paradise. What? What do you want? The riches of paradise. Oh, it's a metaphor. No, 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 no. You and your friends did not pay to get into this infernal place in search of a metaphor. I want in. Right. I tell you what. Let me go up there, check out the prison cell. If there's still anything there after 300 years, you can take this up with Rafe. Now, come on. Letter. Por favor. How are you gonna get up there anyways? Climb. Oh, unless, of course, you want to do it since you want in and all. Just don't break your neck. That's the plan. Hey, did you bring what I asked? Yeah. Get it just over there. Under the work table. Uh, by the grid. There we go. Piece of cake. Bingo. Now we're in business. All right, this should do the trick. There's the prison cell. How do I get up there? Here we go. Slide down there. Look on that post. Probably. Wait till Sam hears about this. <sighs> Onward and upward. Thank you. 
Now, I've got to find the highest cell. Hard to believe there were dozens of pirates holed up in here just waiting to be hanged. Okay, where to? Yeesh. I thought the modern prison was bad. <clears throat> I can barely believe this place is still standing. Spanish sure knew how to build a sturdy prison. I wonder how many pirates died here. Not gonna lie. <laughs> this is pretty awesome. Oh man, Sam is missing out. Here we go. Burns his cell. Cell? More like a suite. Okay. Where to begin? All these squiggles and scratches must mean something. Sun and moon. Alchemy symbols for gold and silver. Wait a sec. I saw something like this on the letter. Huh. Well, that's part of the symbol. Ah. Here's the other half. Now then. That's more like it. Okay, got a zodiac symbol. Sagittarius. And the Scorpio sign. Hmm, Roman numeral ten. <sighs> Nothing. What did that letter say again? The Scorpio sign. And a Roman numeral, two. Roman numeral two. No? Hmm. Well, where's that Sagittarius symbol? Sagittarius. Roman numeral 10.
That's not it. It's not this one either. Nothing. Yeah, I should look at that letter again. Ah, nope. No? Hmm. That's not it. Yeah, I should look at that letter again. Ten and two. X and II. This is it. Right. Time to head back. Come on. <laughs> Gotta watch that first step. Down we go. Do that. Ah, it goes my shoulder. There's Vargas. I want a cut. <laughs> I want in. I'll give you in. Now we're talking. You made it. What'd you find? Drake? What? The place was picked clean. If there's a clue hidden up there somewhere, I couldn't find it. Are you sure? Were you looking in the right place? Oh, maybe I just I missed something in the letter. It could have been another tower that collapsed centuries ago. Yeah. There uh, any plants at this place? You know, like blueprints? Uh, could be. There's a bunch of old files. Okay, great, great. Go look through those, okay? See what you can dig up. Meanwhile, I'll, I'll talk to Sam. He's our Avery expert. Maybe he can make sense of this whole mess. Right. I'll, I'll look through the files. Yeah. Turn around. Yeah. All right. When you're done talking to him, come and find me. You got it. Ah. Gringo, if I catch you fighting one more time, one week in the hole for you. That's a nice acting, Almost as good as mine. Huh? Que puedo decir, eh? Suerte de principiante, ¿verdad? Hijo de puta. 
Uh, uh, lo siento, chicos. Uh, tengo que irme. Claro, te vas cuando estás ganando. Para ti, ¿eh? Uh, Jesus, they worked you over good, you all right? Uh, just another day at the office. Come on. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. You're not gonna keep me in suspense, are you? You were right. <laughs> no, we were right. No. You just gotta find Rafe. No, and... Rafe. Don't, don't start, please. Oh, come on. Like you said, we did this. You and me. Now this rich asshole comes in on the tail end. How long have we been trying to get in here? <sighs> we had some leads. No, we didn't. Okay, not one. So like it or not, no Rafe, no Vargas, and no getting in here. Speaking of Vargas, we got a problem. What kind of problem? Did he let you into the old prison? Yeah, yeah, he did. Right. After he read the letter. Mm. Hmm. So how much does he know? Enough that he wants a cut. Oh, shit. Rafe, if anybody else finds out about this... I'll work it out with Vargas. Don't sweat it. Right now, let's just... Let's get on to more important matters. All right. Let's find somewhere a little more, uh, private. Yeah. All right, coast is clear. Okay, so what do we got? Oh shit! Huh? Hey, may I? Just be careful, okay? Wood with gold and silver inlay. It's well made. <laughs> it's hollow. Why would one of Avery's men go through the trouble of hiding a cheap crucifix? It's not a crucifix. Technically, a crucifix is a representation of Jesus. It's not Jesus. Well, you're right. There's no crown of thorns. He's tied to the cross. Well, if it's not Jesus, then... Read the inscription. Uh, Digna factus recipimus. We receive... We receive... We receive the due rewards of our deeds. Yeah. Look at you. It's a benefit of growing up in a Catholic orphanage. That's St. Dismas. Yeah, a penitent thief. But what's the connection? Guys, let's just pretend I skipped all of Sunday school. <clears throat> okay, uh, during the crucifixion, Jesus is placed between two thieves, okay? One of them mocked Jesus. The other one, this guy, was penitent. Okay? He accepted his punishment with grace. And Jesus brought him to paradise. Penitent thief. Yeah. <laughs> What? You figured it out? There is a cathedral of St. Dismas in Scotland. Wait, the last sighting of Avery was in Scotland. It can't be a coincidence. No. <laughs> you know, I had my doubts about you too, but... Let's find Vargas. Get the hell out of this shithole. Yes, this is the guy you picked a fight with. Ah, uh, didn't know he had so many friends. Te dije que no habíamos terminado. Mira, ya nos ganaste, okay? Muy tarde yeah. para hablar. Aquí no sales. Hey, you know why? Tú no te metas. Okay. Jesus, did you have to pick on the most popular guy in this joint? Ah, uh, you're here. You want it here? Guys, save it for later. Good. I'm good for now. Remember, jab, jab, strike. Jab, We're not done here, guys. Let's make this quick so we can get out of here. I'm an asshole. Let us know, Jesus. Help here! Oh. 
¡Has muerto! ¡Ey! ¡Ey! ¡Que no! ¡Ay! ¡Espera! Ya basta de hablar. ¿Alguien más necesita que le recuerde las reglas? ¡Alíñense! ¿Qué es esto? ¿Eh? Dame. Are you bringing in contraband? Fergus. ¡Cállate! Who do you think you are? Llévalo a su celda. Trae a los gringos a mi oficina. Déjanos. Déjennos. Took you long enough. We almost got killed, you know? You still might. Vargas? Seriously? Oh, I didn't find anything. It must be in a different tower. Well? What can I say? I was raised Catholic. I always carry one. <laughs> Funny. Hey, 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 look. It's worthless, all right? You think I'm an idiot? Okay, you want to renegotiate? Fine, stop acting like a third world thug. Put the gun away. <laughs> Thank you. We're willing to give you, uh, 10%. <laughs> think half. We're doing most of the work, 20, and you'd never find it without us. 25 equals. 25, does that sound fair, guys? I suppose I can live with that. Yeah, sure. I mean, 400 million divides nicely by four. Looks like we have a deal. Yes, we have a deal. And if you ever cross me again... Jesus. That's that. Are you out of your goddamn mind? You wanna find out? I'm done! Guys, what are we doing here? We're sticking to the plan. Was this part of the plan? Just follow me. Come on! Come on! God damn it. Rafe, where are we going here? The lighthouse. Vargas said the boat is right under the lighthouse. If the which way? I don't know. Get outside and figure it out. Get in! Uh, the window! Nathan, give me a hand. Hurry up. There, it's open. Get in, then go! I don't see the lighthouse. Let's just get away from the guard. Down this way! Ha, 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 ha. 
Seriously? Let's clean house! Alright, we need to catch up with Ray. But I thought you trusted him. I do. What point? There's a vent here. Help me push. He's gonna leave without us, isn't he? Not if we're quick. Come on. After you. They're everywhere. Looks clear. Damn it, this place is like a maze. Yeah, it's like they don't want us to leave or something. After this, oh shit, stay guard. This for a while, huh? Hold on, amigo. Great. Good to see you. Get down that ladder for us. We're close. There's the lighthouse. Like I said, stick to the plan. We're not celebrate yet. This way. Let's keep searching over there. There it is. Come on. Don't drop the cross. The boat's just beyond the wall. No. No, I can't. I can't. I can't leave him behind. Nate! Your brother is dead. Either come with me or join him. No, just have it your way. Sam. Oh, God, no. No.
made it to the bottom. Okay. According to your signal, you're at the coordinates. Any sign of our home? No. Not yet, anyway. You got any pings from up there? Afraid not. All right. I'll just keep heading downstream. Copy that. Keep me posted. You got it. Hey, by my watch, you're down to a quarter tank. You want to come up? Nah, nah, I'll be fine. Can't be far. If you don't find it soon, I'm calling it. I'll find it. All right. Hey, I got something here. What is it? It's no rust, right color. Maybe it hit the rocks, tore off before tumbling. Hey, you're mumbling. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it looks like a piece of our wreck. Must be close by. You're teasing me now, Drake. You're teasing me. Ah, there you are. I found it. All right. How's it look? Uh, it's beat up, but intact. All right, here we go. There. Whoa! Morning, fellas. All right, I'm in. It looks like a lot of it's still strapped down. Let's see, we got one, two, three, four, five, five. Okay, by my count, we're shy two crates. I'm gonna go round them up. Hold on. How about you come up first, get a fresh tank? Ah, the crate's gotta be nearby. I can... Ha! Found one. Ah, crap. The crate's pinned beneath the trailer. Tell you what, secure the other crate first, then we'll lift the trailer up for you. Uh, you see, that's why you get paid the big bucks. <laughs> yeah. On the other crate. One down, one to go. Secure it in the trailer. We're nearly at your position. All right, see you soon. <sighs> this thing's getting heavy. Remember, only thing I want to recover from that riverbed is that trailer. That's one crate secure. Good timing. We're right above you. Sling's on its way down. Coming down. Okay, it's in position. Look up the trailer. We'll raise it up a bit for you. Okay, got the cable. I'm gonna try looping it around one of the axles. That should work. Yeah. Alright, that's one. Alright, you watch your oxygen now. That's fine. That's two. 
Okay, trailer secure, ready to go. All right, get clear, we'll lift it up. Ready when you are. And up we go. Okay, that enough? Yeah, plenty. Just don't drop it on me. <laughs> no promises. Okay, we got the other crate. I'm gonna strap it in with the others. All cargo present and accounted for. And with five minutes of oxygen to spare. Jesus. Hey, maybe you should hang out then. See if you can find some other treasures down there. <laughs> nah, I'm good. Wanna ride up? <laughs> I'd love one. Let me know when you're on the sling. Okay, I'm in position. Get me out of here, will you? You got it. Going up. <laughs> Look at that beauty. How you feeling? Oh, better now that I'm out of that river. I'm gonna stink like fish for a week. <laughs> All right. We're gonna come to you. Hang on. Hang on. Good to have you back, Drake. Yeah, it's good to be back. Toss down your gear. Here you go. <coughs> Thanks. <coughs> Whoa, this tank's kind of light. I'm just making your job easier, right? My man. How'd we do? How do you think? Full recovery? Every last bit. <laughs> Making the rest of us look bad. Making the rest of you look good. Drake. How we doing down there? Gotta say that wasn't the slowest dive I've ever sat through. <laughs> Hold on, is that a compliment? Because I'm stunned. Nah, you know what's stunning? Your smell. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I kind of like it. Reminds me of your mom. Wait a minute. Let's wrap this up later. My hero. <laughs> Come on. Let's go see what you brought us. Hey, so how about you let someone else be point man next time? You've earned a break. Oh, no thanks. Take a dive over being at the office any day. Yeah, well, uh, either way, it's gonna be a while to the next dive. What are you talking about? What about Thursday's job? Mm -hmm. Oh, come on, no. Got underbid. You gotta be kidding me. Hey, competition's tough. Let's see here now. Care to do the honors? Yeah, sure. Thanks. That we struck copper. <laughs> well, you'd be surprised how much this stuff is worth. 
Client's paying good money for the full cover. Sure you don't want to just melt it down and make some pennies? <laughs> Come on, let's go celebrate. First round's on me. Bar hopping with you guys? <laughs> no, no, no. Not unless there's hazard pay. Uh, if it's all the same to you, I think I'm just gonna do the paperwork and uh, get home and crash. A rain check, though? All right, suit yourself. Hey, good work today. Thanks. Hey, Nate. Nate, hold on. Hey, what are you doing here? Uh, I got a present for you. Present? Yeah. What's this? I got some news from my contact about that wreck off the coast of Malaysia. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, the ship's intact. Yeah? Cargo's right for the piggin'. You are a persistent one, I'll give you that. And all the money came through for the equipment, too. We are all set. Except, uh, my best guy. The guy I trust for the job, the only one, he, he's got cold feet. My feet were never warm to begin with. And tell me, this contact of yours, did he get the permits? No, he did not get the no. permits. Can't no one get the damn permits? Of course not. But Nate, don't you see that works in our favor? No permits means no competition. The ship is ours. No permits means no go. <sighs> Nate, this is retirement money. <laughs> For the both of us, okay? I don't know about you, but I don't want to be working salvage when I'm 60. Do you? Sure beats prison. No. Listen, I have to pass. And trust me, so should you. Okay, just take it with you. Humor me, I'm okay? not gonna change my mind. Oh, then don't hurt to sleep on it, does it? Say hi to Carla and the kids for me, okay? All right. No pressure, Nate. But think about it. Really did your homework on this one. Narrowed down the search area. It would make a hell of a find. Son of a bitch. <laughs> no, no, no way. You are going with the others. your big brother some years back. Yee, one of the stranger things I've collected along the years. A Spanish doubloon found in a German U-boat in the middle of a jungle. Who would have thunk? Sir Francis Drake takes a bullet for Sully. Sir Francis and his elaborate puzzles. Yeah! Here they come. Take cover, Miss Francis. Bullseye. Take that, and that. Back in business. Eat plastic. Are you coming down to eat? Yeah, yeah, I'll be right there. Well, my time's over. Not really my style anymore. This was a crazy ride.
Oh, is this what you're working on? Researching something. Oh, is that what we're calling it these days? I was. Hey, would you mind grabbing the food? I'm just wrapping up here. Oh, yeah, sure thing. Thanks. Probably too long and full of typos, but that's what editors are for, right? <laughs> God, I'm starving. It looks good. Mm-hmm. So, how was your day? What? Hmm? Huh? Got none of that. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How was your day? Oh, it was fine. Mm-hmm. Typical day in paradise. Mm-hmm. I, uh, I got to pull a bunch of garbage out of a river. Mm-hmm. Yes. At least you got to go for a swim. <laughs> Did you find any exciting garbage? Oh, it was a brilliant stuff. It was a uh, early 21st century truck we got. <laughs> Apparently the natives called it a semi. Oh dear lord. Kind of so, it, boring stuff. Tell me about the article. Well, it started out as this fluff piece about tourism in Bangkok, but I don't think the magazine is gonna like the angle that I'm taking because everyone immediately commented about how rude the smog was, that it was like shock to the lungs, like the second that you got off the plane, so. I kind of took this beauty and this out of Ah. What? Where are you? I'm in here, being stabbed with a fork. Oh, really? <laughs> what? Just keep going. It was, it was interesting. Oh. Yeah. Interesting. What's my article about? What? what? This one? Mm-hmm. It's about, you know, the uh, lost city of Bangkok. Not, not of Bangkok. Lost city near Bangkok, in or about the city limits of Bangkok. Wow. All right, I'm sorry. No, it was valiant. It I was, was in the really ballpark, right? In a different state, but yeah, you were in a ballpark. <laughs> Jameson asked you about that Malaysia job again. Jameson always asked me about the Malaysia job. Look, Nate, I really think that you should take it. You know what? I don't want it. Really? I mean, he doesn't have the permits. And we agreed we're not going to take that kind of work anymore. It's okay, just not worth it. it. It doesn't sound that risky. All right? If it's just a permit. No way. You could call Sullivan. You haven't seen him Elena, in about two years. Well, could we please drop this? Okay, I just don't want you to not take it because of me. I'm not taking it because of me, okay? <laughs> I appreciate the gesture. It's just... I'm gonna go ahead and do the dishes. Stop, I'll do them. No, you did on. them last night. No, you cooked. I cleaned. It's fine. I mean, at least, at least, uh, let me, let me try to earn it or, or something. Let me, um, uh, play you for it. You'll play me for yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your little TV game thing. I bet I can beat your high score. You think that you can beat my high score on my TV game thing? Yeah, I think you're scared now. You don't even know what it's called. I don't need to know what it's <laughs> called. I've seen you play. It's right. jumping and running, and I have a natural talent oh, for that. Really? So, what do you say, chicken? Is it a bet? 
Oh, wow. Okay, cowboy. Okay, watch and learn. Oh, I'm learning, all right. Is this it? No, it has to load. Load? Yes. This is taking a really long time. You have no patience. When you turn something on, you expect it to... Okay, there we go. Crash Bandicoot. Is there a problem? No, no, just, uh... How do you, uh... How do you make it go? Push the start button. I knew that. All right. I got it. Okay, so you want to run towards the camera. Run to the camera. Got it. And the circle button is your spin attack. Spin attack! Yeah, press X to jump. Got it. You'll want to jump over all the pits and the obstacles. <laughs> Come on, that's like my thing. Okay, run away from the boulder. Why is the boulder chasing me? Just run away from it. I did nothing to this boulder. Oh, yeah, way to go there. Not bad, not bad. What is that thing, a fox? A bandicoot. It looks like a fox. It's like a fox in jeans. Okay, smash the boxes. Why is a fox smashing crates? Bandicoot, and that's just, it's what he does. It's a fox, and it's not very realistic. Perfect. By the way, foxes can't do this. It's a bandicoot. I don't look anything like a bandicoot. Have you ever seen a bandicoot? No, but I'm sure they don't wear sneakers. Oh, these graphics are pretty good, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Jump! Jump! Stop yelling at me. I'm encouraging you. I'm coaching you. Keep going. Keep going. Okay, good. What? Is that it? You asked for it. Oh. oh, you gotta be kidding me. I practically had it. You can give it another shot. Come on, double or nothing. My car could really use a good cleaning. Really, really gonna start yeah. the smack talk There's now? There's this mode called easy mode. I just switch it. Wow. It's way no, easier on no, easy Just keep mode. talking. Keep talking. What are you gonna do? I'm, I'm warning what you. What are you gonna do? I'm warning In real life, what hey, can you do? I'm Show me. You. What can you I'm do in you. real life? What do you think about that? Huh? <laughs> Hey, are you happy? Yeah, of course. You? Um? um? <laughs> really? Come here. Not open yet. We're closed. Come on, man. All right, I'm coming. Coming. Asshole. <sighs> yeah, can I help you? Yeah, I'm uh, looking for my little brother. It's about your height, a little bit leaner. Definitely less gray in the temples. Sam? It's good to see you again, Nathan. God, Sam. Oh, all right, all right, all right. Take it easy, take it easy. <laughs> How? How? I thought you... I saw you get shot. Yes, you did. Right there. Huh? Jesus. <laughs> well, the doctors, they... I mean, doctors, they patched me up and they... tossed me right back into the cell. Yeah, but I, I made calls. I, I checked everywhere. I, everything I heard, everything I found, it, it all confirmed you were dead. Well, Nathan, we killed a god, okay? So they wanted to see me rot in that cell for the rest of my life, and I nearly did. He said, Sam, I... Man, if I had known, I, I, I swear to you, I would have you come back. would have come back. I know, Nathan. I know. What's important now, though, is that I'm out. <laughs> Hey, hey, you still with me? 
need some air. <laughs> You're not gonna pass out on me or nothing, I, are you? I just might. <laughs> it's a lot to digest, you know? <laughs> but how, how did you get out? When did you get out? How, how'd you even get here, find me? All right, right, right. Slow down. Hey? Have a seat. I want to hear about you. Huh? Me? Yeah. So what's to tell? Well, call some of your old contacts. They tell me some pretty crazy ass stories. Oh, these were crazy stories. Got shot, hanging from a derailed train in the Himalayas. Yeah, that, uh, that actually happened. Come on, man, what did I miss? Jesus, damn, where do I start? Start with the best part. Uh, do you remember the theory that we had that Sir Francis Drake faked his own death? Yeah, sure. Okay, he did. I found the coffin. Off the coast of Panama? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, now, get this, okay. I open it up, right? right? And there's no body. But the bottom is his old journal. Are you shitting me? I mean, what can I say? Another lost city destroyed, and, uh... We made it out alive. Barely. Unbelievable. Yeah. Yeah, it was. I wish you could have been there. No, it, it's literally unbelievable. You, you tell me you stumble upon yet another archaeological <laughs> gold mine, and somehow you manage to walk away with nothing. Yeah, well, it's a story of my life, I guess. But, you know, I managed to grab a few trinkets here and there. Mm. Paid off the car, the house, the engagement ring, the... Engagement ring? I'm married. I can't believe... I, Elena, from the stories, that's my wife. You gotta come meet her. Tonight, dinner, at my place. You're coming to dinner. I can tell her all about you. Shit, I gotta tell her all about you. Nathan, I'm in a lot of trouble here. What? What are you talking about? What kind of trouble? Is the name Hector Alcazar ring about with you? Yeah, he's the, the drug lord. Mm -hmm. Butcher of Panama, right? Why? It's a funny story, but... Um, last year, he was my cellmate. So this is how I got out of prison. Not reading the night. Samuel, come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Yeah, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> I mean... They have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. Oh. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. <laughs> what will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can, but I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time, which I'm sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. <laughs> Ambition. What is that Avery quote? 
I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. I like how he thinks. What the hell was that? The opportunity of a lifetime. Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Segment the key. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Vámonos. Holy Los shit. Los demás están en posición. How long have you had this plan? Since the moment I set foot in this place. Samuel, keep up. You're going to have to move quickly. Holy shit. Jesus, these men are sadistic. We're doing the world a favor, huh? Here, you'll need this. You remember how to use it? Yeah, it'll come back to me. Abran todas las puertas. Hector, you do that, and you'll start a goddamn riot. <laughs> exactly. Háganlo. Get closer. I see. So now what? Estamos en posición. ¿Están listos? Sí. Busquen dónde cubrirse. Samuel, get behind Sammy. What? Why? Just do it. Oh. You all right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Estamos bien.
Samuel, take cover. Samuel, in a minute, we will either be free or dead. Are you ready? Stay back! Next for Samuel Drake. Huh? Mm. Jesus, what is next? Uh, I think a bath. I'm gonna sleep in a real bed. Mm. Maybe find a nice warm body to sleep next to me. Uh, check my brother down. Seems like a pretty good start. Uh, it is. So, uh, how long? Do you think it will take for you to retrieve Avery's treasure? Uh... I don't know, I mean, I uh, get back to the States, I can resume my search. How long? Uh, it's kind of hard to say until I get started. You said you know where it is? Yeah, uh, I do, okay, but... Listen, it's, it, it's not like Avery left some map with a big red X on it, okay? But I've, I've, I've got some very solid... Oh, okay. J just, just wait a minute. Take, take, take. Hey, take it easy. I like you, Samuel. More importantly, I believed you. 
That is why you are here. I can, I can get it, okay? I, I just need some time. Tell me, Uncle Gio. You see, the problem is, I'm having all these doubts into my mind. Hector, listen to me. I will find it. I swear. <laughs> <that>. <laughs> How long? Six months. <laughs> People are lazy. They always ask for more time than they actually need. Three months. Three months is a bad. Three months. Half the treasure. Can you do it? Say it. Three months. Half the treasure. Now, if you run, or try to hide the treasure. Or do something really stupid, like go to the authorities. Oh no. And when you least expect it, I will be there. At that point, death is not a mercy I will grant you. Here. Come on. Now, the nearest town. 10 kilometers in that direction towards the sunrise. <laughs> it's been a while since we've seen the sunrise outside, huh? Vamos. When I find it, then what? Don't worry. When the time comes, I'll be there to collect. When I swear this, Samuel. Uh, let's me go and here we are. This is bad. We just pick up the trail where we left off and wait, trail? Sam, there's no trail. After Rafe and I escaped, he took his parents' fortune and bought up all the land around St. Dismas Cathedral. We combed that place for weeks. Avery's treasure isn't there. Not that that stopped Rafe. Moron's been digging for years, still hasn't turned up squat. Not really surprised. What does that mean? I just, you know, happened to do a little digging of my own. And, uh, I bet your Rafe doesn't have this. It's really amazing what you can find on the internet these days. It's just the St. Dismas Cross. Oh, is it? Because the one we found was broken and hollow, remember? Holy crap, it's still intact. Avery made more than one cross. So whatever's missing from the one in Panama... ...is probably still inside this one. Mm -hmm. Well, all right. Well, where is this? Oh, this exquisite piece is going up for auction in three days at the Rossi Estate. The Rossi Estate? Well, you know it. Uh, yeah. And how do you plan on securing an invite to an exclusive, heavily guarded black market auction? Well, you don't necessarily need an invitation, per uh, se. Huh? Yeah. And uh, where are you gonna get the money to outbid all the high rollers? I could take a second mortgage out on my house, and it still wouldn't be enough to... Yeah, you're gonna try and steal it, huh? No. We are. Oh, no. No, man, listen, I'm, I can't. I'm, I'm out. What? No, I, I, I just don't do that kind of thing anymore. Besides, there, there are plenty of other guys that are much more equipped to handle this kind of thing. Like who? Um, I don't know, like, uh... Jeez. Anybody, Charlie Cutter. No. You no, know, he's my no, go-to no, guy no, for this sort of thing. No, absolutely not. I don't trust Charlie or anybody else that you've got on that phone with my life, okay? I need you on this one. Oh, man. Sam, there's got to be another way. Not with the time I got left. Certainly not with Alcazar.
Hey, hon, it's me. Yeah, uh, listen, you're not gonna believe this. Jameson just walked in here with the permits. Yeah. I know, I know, but, uh... It's like I'm gonna take that Malaysia job after all. See anything yet? Just a bunch of high-class, low-life criminals all cleaned up for prom. <laughs> and no sign from Sullivan yet. Well, there's still plenty of time. It looks like the storage room's in the building behind the manor. Can you see it from up there? Just the very top of it. Oh, I wonder what they got tucked away in there. <laughs> Let's just focus on Avery's cross, okay? No, you sure you don't want to pick up something for the wife? It's cute. Let's keep it simple. Right, simple. And it'd be a whole lot simpler if it was just the two of us. Sam. We could be inside already. Not cleanly. Have you even thought about a backup plan in case uh, Sullivan gets cold feet? No, because he won't. Or if he got caught? Sam. He knows the people running the auction. He's gonna schmooze his way right through that party, get upstairs, unlock the window, and we're in. It's a solid plan. Uh-huh. All right, fine. Good, say it. What if he stole the cross for himself? Not in a million years. Victor Sullivan. Same Victor we're talking about, right? Yes, he's double-crossed people in the past, but not us. No, not you. I know you two have never seen eye to eye. Huge understanding. But I trust him, all right? He's family. And... No, 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 no. I just need you to trust him, too. Fine. Fine. He'll come through for us. Eventually. But I mean, come on, you have to at least just for one second consider the possibility. There. See? Trust. Try to keep your tux clean. Thanks. <laughs> you know, I can't believe I'm out. I can't believe I'm here with you in Italy, huh? <laughs> yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know? Eh, uh, well... You know, the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh! Uh, so this, this isn't your first time here? No, it's more like, uh, third? Had a couple of odd jobs. Huh? With Sullivan? Well, yeah. <laughs> okay. There's no way up under that bridge. Well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Oh, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm watching. I, uh... I missed. <laughs> nah, see, it's, uh, it's all in the wrist. Here, let me see. Ah, see? Yeah, it's not bad. First, second attempt. Here we go. You see that? Oh, like a pro. It's your turn. <laughs> okay, so where to next?
Hey, let's switch places. Hey, bet we can swing off that beam up there. Uh, definitely. Okay, here we go. <laughs> First try. All right, no one likes a show off. Okay, come on, Nathan. It looks like you can uh, climb down and make your way over. Right behind you. Okay. Ehi, hey, è scommesso sulla partita. Inghilterra vincente. Inghilterra, traditore. Ehi, hey, non confondere l'orgoglio nazionale con la realtà. Ok, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Renner thug was packing some serious heat. Shut up our guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly we won't need him. I hope you're right. Those years. It's the little things that you miss the most. Like what? The smell of fresh citrus. <laughs> uh, riding the motorcycle. It's little things, but they add up. That should hold. All right, come on down. Other wonderful finds. Uh, the ones I missed. You at least take any pictures? I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but camera didn't make it. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I can show you. You have drawings? What, are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. I can't wait. Ah, this looks promising. I think you mean precarious. <coughs> Shit! You okay up there? Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Suck if you missed right now. Sure would. But I don't miss.
Thanks. Uh, Nathan? Nathan? What? Oh, yeah. Okay. You all right? Yeah. How do I look? Like 400 million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Sully? Know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. <clears throat> you remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamned. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm -hmm. Let's, uh, let's try keeping him alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah, uh, about that. What, what about that? Come on, let me show you something. Take a look. That's Avery's cross. We brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Take a whole pile of cash to make that happen. All right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, there's got to be some way we can grab it. <laughs> there is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, but we just need a diversion. Like? Like, um... Like, I don't know. But there's got to be something. Well, if the gods see us <laughs> making for that cross... But they don't see us. Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for, for lights, lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? There's ventilation. Electrical? That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. And that'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. Except there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signore. <clears throat> Antipasti? Hey. Mosa. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Would you focus? The waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Huh? <laughs> That will work. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room. Kill the power. You mean I'm the waiter? You have the best pickpocket. What? You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything uh, hinky goes down. Roger that. All right. Listen, we still got this. Ready? Ready. All right. Follow me. We'll cut through the cellar. Gotta say, Victor, the years have been kind to you. Thanks. I chuckled at the vegan. Really? Yes, I think given me. Scusi? Hello. You see, I thought I had a reasonable grasp of French, or at least a passable French accent. But then a few months back, I'm with my girlfriend by the Pompidou Center. I've just sold them those pieces we, uh, yeah, obtained last year, you know. Cellar's just through there. Let's go. This place is fancy. Of course they play douchey European techno. Excuse me.
You see that? Key card, back left pocket. Yep. I'm on it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You sure you want to do that? There's a lot of eyes out here. I think I can handle a simple lift. All right. Scusami se ti faccio perdere il tempo. Figura, figura. Ok, sono qui.
real smooth. I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, I can tell. doubted me. Pleasure to watch professionals at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself. Are so out of place here. Can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Date? You catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Ross. Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah, right. But you had a run-in with them. That's putting it mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You, uh, stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. You gotta find where the waiters and caterers are hanging out. And lure one out of the kitchen, probably. Man, there's enough food down here to feed a small town. I wonder if they host weddings. Oh, yeah, they're a full service site. Weddings, bar mitzvahs, black market auctions. But do they have a DJ? This skate wasn't on the blueprint. Locked, of course. Okay. There you go. Let's see some fence up there. Nathan, come check this out. be light. Got electric on this joint. Don't suppose you brought a... F yeah, that'll do. I guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Let's see. You need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. Maybe the vent access is behind these casks. It's a lot of really rare vintage. Yeah, maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. <laughs> that's something tells me that's not gonna fly. Well, 
Dead end. Hey, uh, she'll be worried that Victor's chatting up Nadine Ross. I mean, I've heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. I don't worry about Sully. I can talk his way out of anything. Uh, this way. No need to give me a hand or anything. Hold the lighter. Go. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? <coughs> A lot more dusty. Shh, 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 damn it. There's no shortage of waiters around here. I shot with the baby at. Pensi rubati ai ricettatori. Fresh air, here we come. Hey, check this out. See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever, listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All right. All right. Good thing you kept in shape. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? Ah, must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Bingo. Found the kitchen. And of course it's locked. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that to find a window. Drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you up and you take care of the ladder. Got it? 
Buonasera. Ma che sta facendo? He's the other civilian, Sam. What? Right. So he waits to put a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? No, I went in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm gonna head back to the ballroom. room. It's not at... <laughs> Sam, you there? Sam? Sully? Great. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. believe you got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. And what about the horse? Fortunately, we had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> I recognize someone? No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh, like dead out? Oh no, more like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan. How the hell are you? Great. How long has it been? Ten years? Twelve? Fifteen. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. Oh, <laughs> that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big score. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah, I think I want a bit against him. <laughs> but, um, <clears throat> just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. 
Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. I see. <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It? What it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the whole shit, little man. I don't know how you scam your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn Rafe. fight. <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? Nate? God damn it, kid, where the hell are you? Okay. Power room. I can do this. Why did I pick the power room? Speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera. Direi che per stasera può bastare. Ma che diavolo? Pronto? Che cosa? Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid, where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? We don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing, remember? What if he calls my bluff? Won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once. Going twice. Scott. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? 
We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bit brings Don't us worry. to 120. We'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Now but the bit has reached 120,000. Nope. We are now at 140. Nothing. Damn it. Your bid, Signore, takes us all the way to gotta be something. Come on. Hey, man, uh, starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, give me a sec. The bidding stands at 160,000 euros in the room. Yes. Signore's bid makes 170,000. Right now at 180,000 euros in the room. Gotcha. euros. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's beat 200,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice? Then I shall sell it for 500,000 Ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey, stop that guy! Fermo! What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak Spanish. Sam, tell me you got the cross. Got St. Dismas right here. You want to say hi? Yeah, we really kicked the hornet's nest down here. Ballroom's locked down, security's scrambling. Hey, Victor, where's our getaway? Come to the driveway out front. Just follow the spotlights. I'll bring the car around. are everywhere. Okay, maybe we should have brought guns. Ce la faranno. Li troveremo e li riempiremo di buchi. Ma sappiamo cosa fare. 
Resta concentrato. D'accordo. Heading to higher ground to get my bearings. All right, see you soon. Yeah. the ballroom. Driveway's right in front. Okay. Everything's fine. No one got a good look at me. Just gonna play cool. Stroll right on out of here. Oh. Scusi. You're not supposed to be back here. Well, neither are you. But I'll tell you what. I won't tell anyone, if you don't. You have something I want, and you're going to give it to me. Really? Well, I'm flattered, but I'm afraid I'm spoken for. Oh, if you'll excuse me. I'm not in the mood for games. Give me the crucifix. Lady, you're lucky I'm a gentleman. Because if I were... I would... <laughs> All right, fine. <clears throat> Just remember, I didn't want to do this. Let's see what you've got. Come on, Nathan Drake. Oh, I see my reputation precedes me. <clears throat> Don't telegraph something. <clears throat> <clears throat> nice try. I gave you that one. Come here. Now hand me the artifact. Alright, look. I have this nice astrolabe back home, slightly used. I'll give it to you for a fair price. I have a better idea. All right, look. I'm still a little jet lag. How about we just call it? Oh, son of a... Have you had enough? Or do you want to keep being a smartass? Well, you know, being a smartass has gotten me this far in life. Why quit now? in my back pocket. Where is it? Right there. All right, I'm at the car. Where the hell are you guys? Uh, just met your friend, Nadine Ross. She's lovely. Yeah, well, it's total chaos out here. Trying to keep it contained, but everybody's freaking out. I don't want to rush you, but hurry the hell up. Nathan, where you at? Good question. You? By the ballroom. Look for this round sign thing. It's on the way. Round sign thing. Check. Good news is I got a gun. See you soon. <laughs>
Nathan! Catch! Wait, what? Oh, crap. <laughs> hey, I got it! Nice shooting! You all right? Yeah, hanging in there. <laughs> I can't get to you from here. You got a way down? Yeah, yeah, I think so. Okay. I'll meet you in the driveway. Head towards the ballroom. All right, see you there. Victor, I'm kind of stuck here. Any ideas? The fastest way is through the ballroom. You said the ballroom's locked out. Yeah, well, now that they know it's you guys, they cleared the place out. All right, ballroom it is. You get that, Nathan? Yeah, got it. Aspetta. Porto lato. Venite fuori! Ora! Un attimo. to the ballroom. Nathan, I'm pinned down in here. I can use a hand. On my way, Sam. Oh, good.
I hope I don't go to hell for this. Shit. What? It's empty. What? Oh, you're such an <laughs> asshole. He's your brother. All right. Skull and crossbones. Very good sign. Xavier's insignia. What is this? Uh, Odie mecum eris. In paradise. Today you will join me in, in paradise. paradise. It's what Jesus said to Saint Dismas on the cross. Right. But what about these numbers here? What do, what do you make of this? It's some kind of code or a phone number. <laughs> Come on. The dates. Huh? Look. 1659. It's the year Avery was born. 1699. Let me guess. The year he died. Well, uh, by most accounts, yeah, but. That means we have date of birth, date of death, and paradise. Which means we're looking for Avery's grave. It's St. Dismas's Cathedral. <laughs> Wait a second. Hasn't Rafe been scouring that site for ages already? Yeah, the cathedral. See these symbols? Yeah. These are found on old Scottish gravestones. Right. Right? Now, look at this. The layout of this place is really unusual. Uh. Here's the cathedral, but the graveyard is way over here. Rafe's been focusing on the wrong area. Exactly. Guys, we're going to Scotland. All right, all right. Wait, wait up. You do realize that Rafe knows you're coming? Yeah, we can deal with that when we get there. Look, that psycho would like nothing better than for you to show up. Plus, he's got Nadine and a whole army to back him up. Yeah, but he doesn't have this. The biggest pirate treasure of all time is within our grasp. I thought this was about saving Sam. It is. But come on, it's both, right? We need the treasure so we can save Sam. How is Elena cool with all this? Jesus, kid. Look, it's just not that simple. Look, with all that you two have been through together... She wouldn't understand this. You are not giving her enough credit. I can't take that chance. Nathan, he's right. But things have changed. Rafe's involved now, and I can I can take this on my own, really. Great. Well, thank you for your input, both of you. Excuse me. Hey, hey, it's me. Yeah. Now the reception's lousy. Yeah. Something on your mind, dear? 
Look, I, uh, I realize it couldn't have been easy. All those years away. And I'm sorry for what happened to you. <laughs> but it's not his fault. I never said that it was. It took a long time for him to get out of this game. You see a gun to his head? He chose this. Okay, he's meant for this life. You really believe that? <sighs> Why are you here, Victor? Because somebody's got to keep an eye out for him. No, I'll just see you in a few more weeks. Yeah, I will. Okay, I love you too. Bye. Just told her that the job was going to take a little longer than expected, which is the truth, right? So come on, what do you say? Sam could still use our help. Well, <clears throat> I do hear that the weather is particularly fine in Scotland this time of year. Well, Rafe's really going all in, isn't he? Well, they're all concentrated around the cathedral, so that's good. Because we are going to have that graveyard all to ourselves. <sighs> Sully. Yeah? Hey, listen, we're good to go here. Okay, kid. Happy hunting. Last nice chance to come with. Yeah, well, unless you can find me an escalator, I think I'll pass. <laughs> all right. See you in a few. Uh, hey, Nate. Yeah? Just, uh... Ah, uh, just bring me back something shiny, will you? That's the plan. Well, let's go pay our respects to Captain Avery, huh? Scottish Cathedral. Strange place to bury your treasure, no? Uh, not really. I mean, by the time Avery would have sailed here, the place was already abandoned. I guess that's true. Plus, with the massive bounty on his head, it'd be a good place to hide. Yeah.